Okay, so today I am going to ride from my house up in Greensville, Greenville, Jersey City. I would say Bergen Avenue by uh, Stegman area. And we're gonna ride down to Hybrid Cafe, Hybrid Coffee and Kitchen down on Manila Avenue, downtown Jersey City. And they also have a second location that's located down on North Avenue by uh, Journal Square. So we're gonna take a ride down there and uh, I'm gonna check out their coffee and see if their coffee is worthy of my taste buds and maybe sway me from my Dunkin' Donut ways. from my latte that was there, which was $4.75, not bad at all. That's the same price as well, Dunkin' Donuts medium hot latte. But compared to Dunkin' Donuts, Dunkin' Donuts is my favorite, yes. I would say it's better than Dunkin' Donuts hot latte because it's more of a specialty coffee place. Yeah, that was good coffee. So I think right now I'm gonna shoot down to the next location. The next, uh, we have another coffee spot down in Journal Square, and then from there I'll head home. But with my coffee, I have to take my cannabis break because that's just how I just works. I go coffee and cannabis. I usually have them together, but can't do that inside. And I was respecting the people outside by not doing it out there today. Might even make a stop at the dispensary. I doubt it. Maybe. I don't know. Nah. I'm gonna ride through Grove Street and then down to the waterfront.
found a spot. I found me a spot. And many around. I mean, people walking by, but I mean, what can I do about that? So I, f I found a spot. So I am going to smoke a blunt, and then I'm going to head down to the uh, other location, second location. I don't know if it's the first or the second location for the hybrid coffee place, hybrid coffee uh, kitchen. There's a couple that got married over there. That was pretty cool. Well, I don't know if they got married now, but they're taking pictures over there. But I'm gonna enjoy this blunt. I'm not gonna smoke the entire thing, but I'm gonna smoke a good amount of it. And then I'm gonna to head to the other hybrid location because time is getting away from me. So, yeah. around with you guys I went to the other location and just rode over here so uh, let me get the ice latte ice latte yes. you want regular milk regular milk yes and the sugar uh can I have three splendor in it three splendor yeah okay. So I made it to the second location of the hybrid coffee, which is inside this place, which I didn't even know was here. I didn't know this place existed. And it's like a museum on one side. On the other side, it seems like some art and stuff. But I got, this time I got an iced latte instead of the hot latte. Um, again, it's awesome. It's good. It's the same price as I paid for the hot latte, which is about five bucks. A dollar tip, six and some change. We're good, but I, I I like this I like this area. I definitely think my wife and I will come here and check it out. Cool little water tower and stuff up there. I'm definitely gonna come back and uh, explore the uh, the galleries part. And I gotta let my boy uh, Booby know about this because he likes art galleries, which is where we went when we went to Queens. So something in Jersey City. We gotta hit the art galleries in Jersey City. I'm gonna try to cover as much as I can about Jersey City as possible since I live here. Um, as far as the all art and culture and um, anything I can think of when it comes to Jersey City. All, all the positive, not too much of the negative. I can, if I want to focus on the negative, I'm going to stay in my neighborhood. But, which is not that bad, but it's getting, it, it's, it's, it's not what I'm used to. How about that? That's an easy, a nicer way to say. But anyway, uh, this building in front of me has all this art and stuff. The, the whole building is basically one big work of art, you know, so I like it. And this is also not, it, the, the PATH station is right around the corner. Not that I can go to the PATH, but you see the PATH train as you go by. So that's all connected. But as I do, it's, it's not my cannabis break. Got the shade. I'm gonna head home soon. For my overall review on 
hybrid coffee is I like it a lot. If I was to do the stars, I would give it. I would give it right off the top. Five out of five, I would say. Five out of five, yes. Uh, what is my rating system? I don't know. I don't have a rating system. But five out of five means good to me. It means that I would 100% drink it again and recommend it to other people. So far, the best coffee I've had has been uh, uh, um, Cuban coffee in Miami, which I will have next weekend. Because I'll be in Miami then. And I'll definitely spotlight that place because that's something I didn't do last time I'm gonna definitely spotlight that, that that place that Cuban coffee place in Miami in Little Havana but just know Jersey City good, good, has good coffee spots too so this is one out of the out of the many coffee spots this has two locations so next one will be a different coffee shop Different experience. We'll see. So I had at Hybrid Coffee this morning. My hot latte like I like. And I tried out their banana nut muffin and they had like a, I think it was like a, a peach cobbler crumb cake. I tried that. That was okay, a little dry, but the, the banana nut muffin was really good. Really good. I got an extra one for my wife and a latte to go. Who wants coffee? Does anybody want? I just made it. I just made a fresh pot of coffee. 